Style layer processing can now read, feature extract and machine solids ready for automatic nesting within CAD to CAM. CAD to CAM is a nesting engine. Style layer processing automatic machines parts prior to nesting within CAD to CAM. So what I'm going to do now is go into CAD to CAM and first of all we're going to have a quick look at style layer processing. It's going to ask me to clear the drawing on the screen, which is fine. What I have here is something called layer mapping setups. And if I come into here, if I go to edit, this is very much like auto styles. What I have on the left here is a series of layers and we can recognize these layer name from the feature extraction. And what I have on the right here, I have my auto styles. So I can drag different auto styles onto my different layers. If I double click on here, I can do things similar to what I do in auto styles, like set my tool directions, but I'm not going to set anything in here because I'm actually going to use the tool directions that have been generated from feature extraction. I can also say use geometry auto Z levels. Again, these will be created in, um, in the feature extraction. My setup is called UGM. I'm going to give this a job, job name and I'm going to go to my part files. What I want to do is import my files, so I'm going to say add. These are the files that I saved away previously, my um, individual solid model parts. And if I go back now, um, I can have a look at my job data. As I said, I've got a job name in here, and now what I can do is process. So I'm just going to press next. What we can see going on the background is um, the solid models being read in, uh, feature extracted, um, and um, machined. First of all, I need some solid model parts that I'm going to um, process within uh, style layer processing. So what I have on the screen within AlphaCam is a solid model assembly of a cabinet. And I can see on the left here in the layers pane of the project manager the different parts. What I'm going to do is use the command in the file menu, which is save solid bodies to files. I'm not going to align this. And I'm going to say all. So what it's going to do is just save away each of these uh, individual solids as individual files to a separate file. All I need to do now is put a material thickness, which I'm going to put 18 mil in here. And if I say next, here we've got information about reports. And also we've got other things in here. Potentially we can set up multi-drilling, etc. So if I run this now, I'm automatically nesting those parts, machining them, nesting them. And also what it's going to do for me is create report data. So we're going into reports now and we'll be able to see um, our nesting, how many sheets we've used and other information. We've nested here into one sheet. So that was um, what's new in uh, CAD to CAM, the ability to um, machine, automatically process um, solid model parts and obviously use CAD to CAM to automatically nest them.